All right, well, I'm uh, living the dream today. Just drove a couple hours south to come fish with my friend Damien over here. Y'all might remember him. He, uh, he came up and fished with me at a creek uh, a couple months ago, I guess. And uh, now I finally got to come down here. He's going to take me to his creek, show me where the spots are at, where the good stuff is, right? We're going to catch a ton. All right, we're going to see what happens. Oh yeah. That got him to hit a little bit stronger. Red breast. There's number one. Had to downsize my lure just a little bit. And got a little bit smaller hooks. And got one. Well, that's, that's pretty cold. The creek must be cold. Yeah. It's awfully cold. Oh, look at that. That was a big old drum. Will they hit a lure? Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, he hit my rebel crawl and spit it back out. Yeah. They look all right. got something there's there's all kinds of fish right around this area me and Damien over here struggling though right we struggling right now there's a bluegill no oh, not yet I guess oh there's a good one get in here nice bluegill there oh we hooked him in the top of the head It may be a little big. Oh! What? There's a bunch of fish right there. Damon, come here and put these glasses on. Oh, he went up under the brush, Pa. There's drum and bass. Oh, he's moving out. Put these glasses on and look look over there around those trees. See them fish? There's all kinds of big fish right there. Oh, there's one. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, <laughs> I think it was a Kusa bass. <laughs> I couldn't tell. Yeah. There's all kinds of a. Uh... Oh, that's a carp. It's something big. It's big, all right. I think it's a carp, though. Oh, my God. Yes, yes, yes. There's one. I got one. I got one. A good fish. There's a bass behind it. He... The bass you got? Oh! Man, that was a good one. It was. I knew he barely was on there, though. He was a good sized fish, but he was barely on there. Oh, and then I got the tree. Well, at least we found some active. That one came out. He didn't like come out and just kill it, but here. But uh, there's all kinds of big bluegill. Cast in there and give them a big old bluegill. But well, at least it came out and hit. Oh, I hooked him. I hooked him. Dude, hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah, you got him. That's a big old panfish. Uh, yeah. Oh, my. Goodness. What is that thing? Warm mouth, maybe? Rock bass? I, I don't know. Maybe a warm mouth. I think it's fat. I may, have to, I may have to do what you're doing. I think Damien might have taught me how to catch some fish. Yeah, yeah. I, don't know. I didn't bring my pliers. That's a nice fish. Move it just a little bit. You got him. Dude, another one. <laughs> That's a good one. That's another same fish. Oh, I'm about to come get yours. Yeah, that's a good. All right, quit rubbing it in. All right. <laughs> what? You gotta get that on video. I think 
think that's the first one I've seen outside. Not dead on the side of the road. And we got little uh, creatures. Check out this armadillo. They don't have those around us yet. They're coming. They're kind of migrating. That is a funny looking thing. It's not even running off. <laughs> oh man, that's crazy. Oh, got one. It's been a little while since I've hooked something. Let's see what we hooked. Yep, it is a Coosa bass. Alright, here's my first bass I've actually pulled in. That's a Coosa Bass. Oh, Coosa Bass! It's a real, uh, when they're small, they're real colorful sometimes and almost looks like a spot or like a smallmouth, but yeah, it's a Coosa Bass. I'm gonna hold him. Daddy! My warm up. Come on, baby. You're going with me. Yeah, 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 you're going with me. There's one. Not a giant. Wow, that's a pretty bass. You need to tighten up your drag a little bit. There you go. You got him. He's okay. Damien got him a bluegill. Finally got a bass. Yeah. I think it's colorful. Really nice looking little bass. Hey, I just want to say uh, real quick thanks for Mark and uh, Damien for having me out, showing me uh, around down at their creek. I really love exploring down there. The fish, unfortunately, weren't biting very well. We saw lots of fish swimming around. They just really wouldn't hit. So it was kind of a slow day, but still a good time. But I left with some goodies. Mark gave me a little bag of stuff. I'm just going to show you real quick what I got. He knows the kind of fishing I do. Got a couple of things of trout magnet, another trout magnet. Some uh, Mr. Twister. I think these are the things that uh, Tide Pig Patrol uses a lot for um, catching big sunfish. Oh, I love these panfish assassins. This is one, definitely one of my go-to uh, little panfish lures. Uh, more trout magnets. Whole thing of 164th ounce trout magnet jig heads. And a bunch of different little things in the bottom. And I've already used a few of them. But I got some these tiny little uh, Helgramites. Got these little bit of Helgramites here. Real small, perfect for panfish size. Forgot the name of them. A few different things in there. And I actually already fished some with these Helgramites and some of these other lures that are probably going to be in some uh, other videos coming out. But uh, let me show you real quick a few of them. Uh, a few fish, nice sunfish that I caught down below the dam. Oh, nice. We got nice red breast. Red breast. Oh, well, there he goes. Oh, what's a good fish? What is that? What? How is he pulling that strong? <laughs> that's a good bluegill. The current's kind of flowing back in that way. And that's a healthy fish right there. They're tearing this thing up. these guys fight like mad oh nice bluegill oh took my lure off that's a really nice looking bluegill right there all right they're slowing the water down it's gonna go really low so I don't know if it's gonna help me catch fish or not but we're gonna see
Yeah. Man, these are pretty fish. Nice red breast. There's one. There's all kinds of red breasts in there. These places. I know there's a lot of fish in here, but I didn't realize how many little guys there are. Or actually, these are good size for little guys. There's one. Whole bunch of them right there. Pull like crazy. Bluegill, little trout magnet. Oh yeah. Oh, what is that a bass? Yes. Little spotted bass. Pretty fish. Oh, and he's off. Hey, thanks for watching. Uh, appreciate all the support. Everybody's been uh, commenting, watching videos, uh, liking them, doing things like that. And yeah, I'm going to keep making videos that are some days that are not always going to be awesome and amazing. Um, just maybe a just average fishing day, maybe a, a poor fishing day. A uh, day like this where we didn't catch a ton of awesome big fish or anything. It's just some normal fish, normal day uh, type of fishing. Got to see the armadillo, which was really cool. I don't know if you see them around where you're at, but uh, actually that's the first time I've ever seen one like uh, that was still alive, usually just dead on the side of the road when I'm traveling somewhere. But um, just, yeah, I still enjoyed making this video. Appreciate Damien and Mark. Thanks for watching.